Hello everyone, I'm Meg Coker, Dr. Moorfield Lang's graduate assistant, and this is Tech 15. Today we're looking at the truly wonderful Wonderopolis here at wonderopolis.org. That is W-O-N-D-E-R-O-P-O-L-I-S dot org. So here on the homepage you can see the different categories, Wonder of the Day, Explore Wonders, What Are You Wondering, Vote for Wonders, Educator Sandbox, and Camp Wonderopolis. And we'll look at each one of these briefly. Today's Wonder of the Day is Why Do People Cough? Each Wonder of the Day has a gallery which includes images, a video, questions associated with it, including the title question often, a very good summary, as well as keywords that are good for building vocabulary, further information and things to understand, including some possible experiments or things to notice, places for more information that are related, and a test, as well as different categories, tags, and a hint at the next wonder of the day. Explore Wonders allows you to look at previous wonders of the day, which includes a little bit of everything, from something like how do rocks get their colors, to how much does it cost to own a horse, or what is a water wheel? You can explore by most recent, which is what it is right now, most popular, you can select a grade or a subject material, and you can click reset straight from it or go by category up here at the top. And at what are you wondering, you can submit questions through this simple form that includes a permission area for the parents if their child's submitting a question, where you can also see the other questions that have been submitted by other users. You can also vote for wonders, which shows those questions that have been submitted, which you can see also by most recent and most popular. And up here at the top, also submit your question there. Now, some things worth noticing are the educator sandbox here, which includes blog posts, materials submitted by contributors, another great place for you to be able to look by grade or subject, as well as tweets by the Wonderopolis account and related accounts. And last but not least, Camp Wonderopolis, which is set up primarily for the summer, but if I remember correctly, you can sign up now as well. It includes different arenas where you can learn about different subjects from zoology to botany, astronomy, physics, through fun activities. Let's open one up lessons that are associated with it where you can choose a lesson as fun videos activities etc another thing about camp wonderopolis is that there's a wonder wall that's interactions between the campers and more details here on what is there so uh, this has been a brief introduction to wonderopolis hope this has been helpful and have a great day thanks for watching